Boyfriend wants me to pay for our future kitchen. My boyfriend and I live in different states. We've been together for four years and have been doing long distance for about 1.5 years. He bought a house in the state he's living in and the plan is for me to move in within the next year. He is currently working on the kitchen and has been struggling financially to pay for it. He's asked me if I'd be willing to contribute. I'm very good at saving money and only really spend on rent. I also wouldn't want to move in without the kitchen done, very old and hard to cook in. He says that I should pay for it since I'm requiring it to be remodeled prior to moving in. Should I do it? It'll be about $30,000. Edit 1. He definitely wants to remodel the kitchen regardless of me moving, but I refuse to move in without a working kitchen. It's hard to cook in there without wanting to puke. Not unless you're getting added to the deed of the house. If he's willing to write up a contract that you're entitled to any equity you put in, maybe, but honestly that's still a pretty bad idea if you're not married. 30k in exchange for name added to the deed sure. Otherwise he can screw right off with that thought. Absolutely do not do this, unless your boyfriend wants to add you to the deed. Would be a massive mistake. Personally, I would be willing to do it if my partner was willing to put a lien on the mortgage with a 10 plus year clause. If you stay together 10 years or longer, the lien ends as you'd have gotten full life use of the kitchen. I'm also a former Finnish carpenter slash cabinet guy. Whatever you do, do not buy the particle board cabinets. The plywood boxes will cost more, but they will last 15 plus years whereas the cheapest may only last 5. Absolutely not. It would be insane to contribute $30,000 to the remodel of a home that you do not own. No. Your name isn't on the title. Do not finance his home improvements. The plan of you moving in could change. If he wants your dollar, your name goes on the title before he gets any money. Absolutely not. You have no financial interest in this house. Put the money into your house. If your name isn't on the house deed then no. Don't be an idiot. If marriage was happening soon maybe, but you aren't even engaged. He wants you to invest $30,000 in that house then your name should be on the deed. And you should have it in writing that you contributed that money and get it notarized. You aren't married so there's no legal ties between the two of you. Unless you're on the deeds I would. If you break up you'll just be able to sell a house for a profit that you won't see. And don't lend him the money either. You have no idea what will happen by the time you come to move in. Next year is long enough for things to radically change between you. Can't he install a cheaper kitchen? Not sure if that's normal where you are but doing the conversion to pound, that's a massive amount. No, if you aren't on the title deeds, it's not your responsibility. No, you don't live there and have no financial, lawful entitlement to the house. Should you invest $30,000 in a home that you have no ownership in? No, absolutely not. 30k on a house you have no legal rights on? No ducking wave. Why does the kitchen need to be remodeled? Is it small or outdated? Is it really a requirement for you to move in? Is he gonna put you in the deed in exchange? How are you gonna have any say in the remodel with you living in another state? Don't do it unless you're on the deed. He could have chosen another house that didn't need work. I might consider it if he signed something that said if you break up within X years he would pay. You back lol. No. Two reasons first. It's not your house. Second your relationship is long distance. How much time have you actually spent together? Do you know enough about each other on a day-to-day -day basis to actually commit to uprooting yourself? And moving into a house that you have no equity in. With someone that you've spent limited time with? I'm not saying that your relationship has no chance of succeeding but it is a huge risk for you. Even without spending 30 grand on someone else's house. If he puts your name on the house sure. 
If not no it's his house home. If you're not on the deed that's a hard no don't be an idiot. Wait, if it's hard to cook in, how is that something he's doing for you? Doesn't he cook in his own kitchen or for some reason is that your space? I'm making a very skeptical face right now. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epicaracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.